So we are going to dive into the types of machine learning in other slides in more detail, but this is just kind of an overview so that you can kind of see these terms up front. Um, so we'll just quickly go through this here. And we're gonna group them um, based on what they're trying to do. So the first is learning problems. We have supervised, unsupervised reinforcement. These are three terms you're gonna hear quite a bit with machine learning. Uh, the key thing here is that supervised is where you have labeled data and unsupervised is where you're working with unlabeled data. For reinforcement, this is an agent, an agent that operates in an environment and must learn to operate using feedback. And this kind of sounds like agentic workflows or agentic coding when we're talking about Gen AI, which we'll learn about later. But the idea is like, imagine you wanted to make a, uh, a machine learning model that played the, the Mario or, or the Sonic video game, that'd be using reinforcement learning, okay? Then we have hybrid learning problems. So we have semi-supervised, self-supervised, multi-instance. So semi-supervised is where you have uh, a mix of labeled and unlabeled data. You have a lot of unlabeled data and a little bit of labeled data. And so um, that's kind of a, a, a mix between supervised and unsupervised. You have self-supervised. Um, and I believe that this is where um, the idea is that it can label its own data, I think. But we'll find out later on in future slides. We have multi-instance where we have um, examples of unlabeled data. And so then we just kind of bag them together. Um, again, we'll cover that later on. We have statistical inference. So here we have inductive, deductive, and, and transductive. So using evidence to determine the outcome, you, or and then we have deductive, using general rules to determine the specific outcomes. And then we have transductive, used uh, to predict specific examples given specific, uh, specific things from a specific domain, okay? Then for learning techniques, we have multitask, active, online, transfer, and ensemble. So multitask is fitting a model on one data set that addresses multiple related problems. Active is the model is able to query a human operator during the learning process. Um, online is using available data and updating the model before a prediction is made. It kind of sounds like RAG when we're talking about Gen AI. Um, but again, this is just general machine learning, right? So we have transfer and model is first trained on one task and then some or all the models used as a starting point for, uh, for related tasks. And then we have on, uh, ensemble where uh, two or more models are fit on the same data and the predictions from each model are combined. So yeah, we're gonna see these terms again, but just trying to get it uh, up front here for you, okay?